I have 30K and you want to invest passively. So passively means you're going to give somebody money in a project and you're going to get a return on your money, hands off, kind of set it and forget it, right? For six months, for a year, or for five years. So here are the tips on how to be a passive investor with only 30K. All right, by 30K, I keep getting that number. People say, hey, I have 30K to invest passively and I have 30K to invest actively, right? But we're going to talk about passive. That's like the number that I get quite often, uh, 30K on the passive, uh, the active side. I get some 30K on the passive, even though I get some that are 100K plus. But I want to hit with the 30K. So how can you be a passive investor with $30,000, right? If somebody's going to pay you back 6% interest or 8% interest or 10% interest a year, that's, you know, $2,500 to $3,000, right? It's not life-changing money, right? But it's still something, right? It's better than keeping it in your bank. I can tell you that already. But, you know, how can you grow that a little bit quicker, right? You can tell somebody, you can partner with somebody who's being an active investor who's doing flips and say, hey, look, I'm going to give you 30 grand, help you out with this flip. But in return, I want 10% of the profit or 20% of the profit instead of an actual return, right? Instead of an 8% return or 12% return. Now, usually you can do this with people who are, you know, either new some that are experienced may not want to do that with you just because they probably have cheaper money somewhere, right? But if it might be somebody who's a little bit newer, who's, who's really hungry and is willing to pay you, say, hey, we're going to make 30%. You give me the down payment for the property. I'll do all the work. And we, sp we split the profits 50-50. Maybe there's a $20,000 profit in five months. You keep 10. They kept 10. Now in six months, you made $10,000, but you would have made all year if you lent it to somebody at 8% interest. So, it is a little bit riskier because usually it'll be somebody newer getting started that doesn't have money for a down payment. That could be a friend. That could be somebody you met, right? Just do your due diligence. You know, don't just give anybody money up front because I don't want you to lose your shirt, all right? But you can invest passively with 30K. You can actually multiply that pretty quickly. You know, just like the example I told you, just partner with somebody, get a percentage of the profits. Now, if he only makes five grand, well, you only get 2,500 if you're keeping half. So you didn't, maybe you didn't make your return. So there's risk and there's reward um, for that type of model. Or you say, hey, look, I'm going to just save as much money. And give me 8% a year. Here's my 30K. I don't want to see it. And you're making your 2,500 bucks, you know, 3,000 bucks a month. I mean, a year. And you're just hands off passive and you stay with your, in your lane. Maybe you've got a job, you got a career, something you're, somewhere you're headed, you got a family, and you don't have time to really deal with that or you just have extra money, right? And you want to just diversify $30,000 into real estate. See how that goes. So you can be a passive investor with $30,000. Can you be a passive investor on like syndications, like projects that I do, um, or people like me? You know, usually they require $100,000 or 50K per syndication, 30K. Always ask, say, hey guys, I have an IRA and I have 30K in it, will you take it? You know, if the minimum is 50, they might say no, but it never hurts to ask if they'll take your 30K. Easiest way to make money in real estate, if you have money, put it in passive, if you want to, if you want to have a lifestyle and not actually work and keep doing what you're doing, it is actually a wonderful way to make money with your money. Check the rest of my videos. I have another video on how to invest 30K as an active investor. It's another video in case you don't want to be passive and you want to be more hands-on and try to make more money with your money.